This is called a hand inhaler. It is a device that delivers a dry powder medication used to treat COPD. The medication is contained in capsules that come in blister packs and are used with the hand inhaler. The capsules should only be taken out of the blister when you are ready for your dose. Do not swallow the capsule. It must only be used by inhaling it with the hand inhaler. We will now demonstrate how to use a hand inhaler. Hold your hand inhaler and open the dust cap while pressing the green button on the side. Open the mouthpiece by pulling up on the edge from the base. You will see the center chamber where to place the capsule. Peel back the foil of the blister that contains the capsule by pulling on the tab and remove one capsule immediately before use. Place the capsule in the center chamber of the hand inhaler device. Close the mouthpiece firmly until you hear a click. Leave the dust cap open. Hold the device with the mouthpiece facing up and press the green piercing button once only. This makes a hole in the capsule which allows the medication to be inhaled. Exhale fully away from the inhaler. Raise the mouthpiece to your mouth and make a tight seal with your lips around the mouthpiece. Breathe in deeply. You should hear or feel the capsule vibrating as you inhale. Hold your breath for five seconds and then take the device out of your mouth. Now you can breathe normally. To make sure you inhaled the full dose, you will need to inhale the same capsule a second time. Do not press the green piercing button a second time. Exhale fully away from the inhaler. Raise the mouthpiece to your mouth and make a tight seal with your lips around the mouthpiece. Again, breathe in deeply. After you are finished taking your daily dose, Open the mouthpiece and tip out the used capsule into a disposal bin without touching or holding the used capsule. Close the mouthpiece and dust cap. Store both the inhaler and blister packs in a cool dry place and do not expose them to extreme cold or heat. Always check with your doctor if you have any questions about your medication or use of your inhaler.